Hi, this is Dave Littman at Truth in IT, and I am bringing you another edition of Extreme and R. And today I'm speaking with Bernie Bain. Hey, Bernie. Hi, Dave. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm doing well. Thanks for joining us. Uh, Bernie is a principal technical marketing engineer with Avir Systems. So, Bernie, uh, tell us a little bit about Avir and what you guys are doing in uh, cloud compute and storage. Thank you, thank you. So Avere Systems, uh, you know, we are a company that we focus on enabling the, what we call the ultimate cloud, hybrid cloud flexibility. Okay. And essentially we offer a solution that allows customers to both leverage their on-premises investment with compute and storage, and also extend that into the public cloud, as well as private cloud uh, storage. So essentially we enable customers to play in what we call all four quadrants of the public and private uh, compute environment. So you have your on-premises storage and your on-premises compute, and then you have cloud storage and cloud compute. And we have technology that enables our customers to pick and choose and leverage all four of those components at their at the desire. Okay, and so you can mix and match. You can have local compute, you could have remote storage, you could have cloud compute, local storage, right? Absolutely, absolutely. Okay, and you guys have uh, the technology to overcome latency that uh, you know, one might be concerned about, even when we're talking about massive workloads and massive amounts of data. Correct, correct. Uh, the, the foundations of our technology were based on file system caching techniques. Um, so we built a scale out, highly available cluster technology that allowed you to, uh, you know, uh, deliver many, many uh, gigabytes per second of throughput to workloads. And essentially we do this through file system caching. And now we've extended that technology to operate both in front of public cloud storage, which obviously is remote and served off the internet, so there's a latency component involved there. Or if you start doing cloud computing um, and your data resides on premises and you're also now facing a latency and bandwidth problem, and our technology with the caching allows you to, to, to benefit from that. Okay, cool. And uh, you guys are gonna be at Supercomputing 16, SC16. And uh, tell us a little bit about what you're gonna be showing. You guys have uh, announced some interesting news recently. Absolutely, yeah. So our latest announcement is uh, what we call the C2N or the uh, Cloud Core NAS. And this is a, uh, a package from Avere that includes both the Avere Edge filers and a uh, private object storage component. And this enables uh, our customers to really start at an at a entry level of a capacity uh, in terms of not having to go whole hog and getting multiple petabytes of capacity from other private object storage vendors out there. Instead, they can start with an Avere solution that is tightly coupled um, and, and unique in that way that it offers a file-based interface to the uh, scalable object-based storage. And, and cool. So you also don't have to get locked into a cloud vendor and have that monthly recurring revenue, uh, that monthly recurring cost either. Correct, correct. So, you know, some customers choose to, to put their data in the public cloud and they're fine with that monthly kind of recurring charge. Other customers bring stuff back on prem eventually and keep it there. So they're always looking for options and how they can store data and how they can move data around. Okay, cool. And so, you know, with this kind of solution, you can, you know, even though you can handle massive amounts of data, you can kind of, you know, start small and take your time getting there. Absolutely. Yeah, we often joke around here that we say we can accelerate a massive workload against one byte of data, or we can uh, accelerate a massive workload against you know multiple petabytes of data. Okay, cool. And you are, I mean, this is object storage, right? So it's got all the benefits: erasure coding, you know, geo dispersed data location. Talk about that a little bit. Absolutely. So you know, object-based technology has been around for a little while now, um, but most of the customers that are looking for high storage capacities also want to avoid the backup conundrum. Yeah. So they're looking for solutions that are self-healing and and durable. So yeah. the erasure coding comes in play. Uh, the scalability of capacity comes in play. The only shortcoming with native object storage is the lack of a file interface. So most legacy applications can't interface directly with it. Our technology has what we call our flash, flash cloud technology, mm -hmm. enables you to glue those two components together and have a native file object interface for uh, NAS protocols while leveraging the object-based storage uh, capabilities. All right, cool. Now, I got a question that may stump you, and if it does, no worries. Do you know what booth you're gonna be at at SC16? Oh, that is a really good question. <laughs> no <laughs> worries. I will put that on the video on the bottom. Um, and Bernie, hey, it's been a pleasure speaking with you. Thanks for taking the time. Excellent. Thank you, David. All right. Hey, again, we've been speaking with Bernie Bain with Avere Systems. Check them out at SC16. And yes, we will put the booth number on the video. Thanks for watching, everyone. Make it a great day. Thank you.